Good morning, Mr. Cole. Can you tell us something about your products and services and your company? Okay. Um, well, with respect to the company, Cole & Associates, so the full name being Cole & Associates Engineered Safety Systems Limited, has been in existence for 21 years. Um, we are involved in the design, supply, installation, and maintenance of safety systems. Uh, that's really the engineering side of safety. And we've been doing that for 31 years. to uh, garments, which is safety garments, uh, the manufacturing of safety clothing, coveralls, shirts and pants, reflective vests uh, and so on. Uh, so generally we work a lot in the energy sector, commercial entities as well, providing fire systems, fire alarm, security systems, access control, CCTV fire extinguishers, uh, as I said, safety clothing. Uh, We've done quite a bit of work throughout the Trinidad Tobago and the wider Caribbean, installing these systems, doing designs as well, as well as providing training um, and industry safety training and so as well. So that is generally a much of what we do. Well, tell us, what was your experience on the Expo TT led mission to Guyana? Well, um, it was actually quite exciting. It also bore a lot of fruit for us in terms of. We were happy with the number of interviews that we had. I think it was about 40 different companies that we met with, um, including some companies who actually were very interested in partnering with us uh, along different lines. There's one particular company who um, we are quite interested in partnering with us in terms of manufacturing um, garments. Um, we are the uh, sole representatives for kernel, uh, flame resistant uh, material and so we manufactured that particular brand of flame resistant clothing in Trinidad and we sell to the wider uh, energy sector in Trinidad and we've been seeking to sell that same brand to the wider uh, Caribbean market and this company they are a, a, a pretty large manufacturing entity they're looking for expansion of a company to partner with in terms of providing the labor and the machinery to do just that. We provide materials because we are a rep and they are willing to actually carry that out for us for a, wide, a, a larger um, market, so to speak, because Sri Lanka was market is very limited, but we are planning to go into the Latin American market as well. And hence that would require a, a, a larger organization to manufacture the quantities that would be necessary to supply that kind of market. So it was very um, beneficial as a matter of fact. Very recently they sent us a couple of emails. Um, we have even had uh, further discussions with the companies in terms of further partnerships in terms of supplying our expertise in engineering and training. Um, one last thing, we met with one of the uh, consultants very recently came to Trinidad and had meetings with us with respect to the setup of our office in Ghana. And we will be going back to Ghana later this month to start that process. Okay, because I want you to share with us how your business have been thus far. Yeah. Um, so, you know, the leads have led to just being there alone at, at that time. Mm -hmm. A couple of um, companies who spoke to us actually gave us the opportunity to provide our proposals for their facilities in terms of providing uh, fire systems. One which we submitted so far and the other we are working on. Uh, these are very large entities, one a manufacturing entity that is uh, getting further into export on a larger scale and another company which is uh, providing the oil services sector which is just developing with a lot of their um, materials. And so they expanded their warehouse storage and, and logistics facilities. So we provide them with uh, proposals for the safety aspect of, of the business. So for us, you know, 
even if we get one job, it would have been for just the trip. You know, and, and we see you know a lot more coming out of that. So we're quite happy with what. Would you attend any future missions with us? Yes, definitely. Definitely. We are, we are very enthused about any other that would uh, that would be coming up. Okay, well, just for information, we are going to Costa Rica, Panama this in March and we expect to go to Colombia sometime in September. So if you're interested, please let us know. Definitely. Um, we gained a lot from the first one and we would definitely want to take part in any further mission, um, especially as we are an um, export driver ourselves to get out and you know, get into additional markets. Would you recommend any of your colleagues or partners to attend a mission with Export TT? Yes, um, once a company is willing to get into the export market, we would surely recommend that they attend. Mission. It's very organized, so you don't need to go um, try to find contacts on your own. So, you know, just for that in itself, I don't believe that you have gotten those types of contacts in such a short space of time if we try to arrange it ourselves.